What that mean? So what? what like what does that mean? Some old artists finna get fucked over. Yeah, be, he, be ready. He can say he, he probably fucked over some, and some fucked over him. Who gonna fuck? How you gonna fuck I, over I, him? That what came out his mouth. Like, but how is that possible though? Logically right. thinking, how can you fuck over that type of thing? Bro, you I did. Don't know. Them words came out his mouth. Those are lies. We're here about to tell lies. So. Yeah. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One on One. Because from what, what, what's going on now, what's really going down is a sports agency and uh, a label, a record label. I mean, a, 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 you know, he, he is a, a full-fledged label now, according to what I'm hearing. Uh, okay. What does that mean? So what, what, like, what does that mean? Some old artists finna get fucked over. Be, yeah, he, be ready. He can say he, he probably fucked over some and some fucked over him. Who gonna fuck? How you gonna fuck over hey, him? That what came out his mouth. Like, but how is that possible though? Logically right. thinking, how can you fuck over that type of thing? Bro, you I did. Don't know. Them words came out his mouth. Those are lies. Well, everybody tell lies. So. Yeah. So you gotta pick them out. So you, you, when he when he said that, basically he didn't know K Breezy and he didn't stop her career. Explain to me why K Breezy yeah. went for a three day rent on a guy that she never met one day in her life. That messed up her career. That messed up her career. Cause that's exactly what he alluded of, to. Of course he's met her before with A Tony Films. He'll act like he hasn't, but he has. So he did meet her yeah, with A Tony. He's met K Breezy. Like that's a damn. Man. Who is A Tony Films? She shoots out of videos for K Breezy. She shoots a lot of videos out here. They oh, that's the, that's the little girl that be with Spot him, got him. She out here. She shoots shit for Spot him. I didn't so that's how that's how her. you know she know. So and and they met each other. They Louis met Tony. And, yeah. and, and and so they do know each other. Uh, like far as uh, they've like, seen each other, yeah, been in the same room. Each other what did some. he have to do with her career though? Like so how could he have stopped deal, her career? We signed the deal is with Sela V, which is which is Stan, and Stan is Sean Cotton's partner in, in the business. Business partner. You dig what I'm saying? Let me say so, two so people. DJ Duffy and Sean Cotton are who are his 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 patrolmen to go out here in this area and get the artists and shit. That's how we even came across Stan was through yeah. Duffy. So when he get up here in line and say I wasn't around when Breezy signed the deal, I was at the table. Me, Mr. Johnson, which is the City Girls lawyer yeah. and King King Von lawyer, her brother, the producer, K Breezy, and Supreme. You dig what I'm saying? We like he he was there hiding. He never showed his face. Even Stan was trying to get us to because he would he tell people, I don't have a problem with Supreme. You have to say that though. That's the politically correct answer because you really don't have a problem with me. You're just a hater. Yeah. And and I'm the truth. So just like when he told people that he he told Yeah Yo not to take the QC deal. That's a damn lie in a million years. We hopped in my Jeep in my house in Atlanta and drove Coach K sent us the address and, bu and P buzzed us in. Well, nobody there but me and Yayo. No, and Yayo wasn't even in the meeting when we had the meeting. It was Coach K right here and P right here. You dig what I'm saying? Yayo was in the in the in their in the studio doing a Zaytoven beat. You dig what I'm saying? So it just to be a lot of lies going on, man. Because when we left there, we went to Warner Brothers, um, Atlantic Call, the guy who signed Charlie Pugh and Kevin Gates and Kalani. Yeah. We went to 300. This shit is happening. Without nobody helping us with shit, me and Yayo, and I didn't spend a lot of money. I ain't spent a lot of money with none of my artists. That's how I know this is a blessing. So, like I said previously, when those guys go to doing all the hating and shit, it don't mean nothing to me because I know how I walk and I know what's going on. Yeah, so you. now we doing this documentary on the the La Rasa, and you, you here come Rainwater with this dry hating. But I'm thinking I'm over here somewhere where you can't fuck with me at, and here here they come again. You dig what I'm saying? But uh. It's, it's out there now. It's, you know, with me, our publicity is good publicity. Why do you think they keep coming at you? Um, I think they come at the movements. It ain't me. They don't really. They don't have a problem because if they was in here right now, they gonna act like they seen a star. They gonna shake my hand and hug me and smile, and they gonna go over here and sit down. They not gonna be on none of that shit. So I can't tell you. It's a tricky question, but I don't think like them, so I don't know. Wow. So <clears throat> when you when you um. You you say that these these guys okay, um, Sean Cotton never. I'm going back to him because I want to understand how he said that these guys pretty much that was using that you guys met with would use him as a plot to get people to sign to say that they could be on say cheese. He said what? The guys that you guys met with in Miami, the Miami those people. Those are his, those are his He stands. says, hold on. Okay, let me say this. All that shit he be flashing in Miami, that ain't his. That's Stan shit. 
Okay. Because you want to be technical. None of that, the weed shit, all them, that ain't his shit, man. That's a, man. Okay, but he, he said, said. that was his business partner. Correct. That he said, same, but he said like that me. they, they, but that's why he don't do business with them no more. Yeah. Because he said they would use, say, cheese as a, as a, as a, like a springboard to get people, which makes sense. Um, They met her. Their sales pitch was, you have a song going Viral on TikTok. We're gonna get you on Say Cheese. We're gonna <clears throat> we're gonna um do this. You're gonna get an interview. You're gonna get so many Say Cheese posts per week. I've never met her to my to this day. To this day, I've never had a conversation with this girl. You never talked to her, not one time. If I'm lying, my Say Cheese account gonna get deleted. Nah, but he's lying to get bro. people to sign because they know they would have a Say Cheese play. You know yeah. what I mean? They get to play they, they videos. The say, uh, they get the interview with Say Cheese. They get the they get to the open that gate stuff, up. Yeah. And when that didn't happen for K Breezy, you guys felt like y'all was you let know, down. This 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 the thing. We only went over there with them for TikTok. We had everything else. K Breezy was the only artist in the Metroplex going getting paid to come to the middle schools, high schools, and elementary schools. Nobody was doing that. Not nobody. So when Stan them reach out to us, to us through DJ Duffy, we get down there. We don't know Sean's involved. When we find that he's involved, we're like, okay, whatever. We still trying to do business because business is over everything, right? Yeah. So you, so now look at, think about this, y'all. You signed to this company. I told you this before, E. So in your best interest is to make money, right? So if I got a hot artist, if I like your ass or not, if I know you hot and I post you, it's gonna make me money. Why would not do that? So he posted her one time because Stan made him, and he posted her again, and, and we're trying to clown her by the, by the hairstyle that we did on a uh, for an album cover. It didn't work. It backfired. So he the, could, the, what didn't work? The fact that when he tried to clown, he her? he tried to clown her, and but everybody, it didn't work. Hell no, nah, it didn't work. Okay. Nah, it didn't work. So those are two posts that he that he that he made for her. You dig what I'm saying? Now we didn't beg for those posts, but. Ignorant ass bo little boy, if this is your company and you can make money from this hot artist, why not post her to make money? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.